Hey everyone, welcome back. Today I am sharing a DIY Christmas gift with you. It is going to be customized essential oil blends or perfumes. And this video was a collab with three other green beauties from across the globe. We've got Emma from Chemical Detox, Jenna from Natural Beautiful Life, and Rachel from All Natural Aspirations. So that's so cool and we've each chosen a different DIY gift to take you through a tutorial of. So I chose to do custom essential oil blends um, or perfume because it's a great way to get people sort of thinking about using natural fragrance instead of synthetic fragrance and you can really tailor and customize the blend for the person that you are making them for. So last year I actually made several of these and tailored them and this year I kind of just picked one blend and went from there. So the easiest way to do it is to pick one blended already essential oil, but you can certainly make your own recipe and I'll, I will link some sites below of recipes that I have used in the past. So the one I used is called Child Chiller. It's from Snow Lotus. It is a blend of rose geranium and sweet orange. So it is calming. Uh, the rose geranium is great for hormone balance and a lot of women love the smell of rose geranium. And because it's not a pure rose geranium and it's mixed with orange, it's not overwhelmingly florally strong. It's just a nice light floral fragrance that also has some calming and um, energetic and hormonal awesomeness to it. So Worry Free from Snow Lotus is also a really, really fabulous blend. Any sort of citrusy blends too. Some other of my favorite mixtures would be lemon and peppermint or peppermint and lavender. Is Peppermint and lavender is like does it all kind of a thing. So anyways, let's jump right into the tutorial. So you will need a carrier oil, your essential oil blend, a tiny pipette, and a roller ball bottle. So first things first is you are going to drop between 30 and 40 drops of the essential oil blend you want to use into the roller ball bottle. These bottles can be found on Amazon for fairly inexpensive. And then when you're done dropping in the oil blend, you can add your carrier oil in, fill it up to the top, and this is where the pipette will come in handy. I used fractionated coconut oil as my carrier oil. This is coconut oil that stays liquid. However, you can use whatever sort of carrier oil you'd like. You can use sweet almond oil, jojoba oil, apricot oil, the list goes on and on. Whatever is your favorite liquid oil to mix essential oils with. Then you'll need to squish the rollerball part of the bottle onto it, which is pretty difficult. And then put on the lid, draw some cute little doodles with a metallic marker, and write the name of your custom blend on there for your special giftie. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing how I made these custom essential oil perfumes and that maybe you want to figure out how to do these for your own Christmas gifts this year. Please remember to check out the other girls' videos. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time.